We just arrived at the Pendry Hotel in San Diego. This room actually is perfect. We need something where it has a uh, room separation. So that way you can go to sleep and we can still hang out and be up. There's a play area for you. What do you think? Oh, also at the front desk, they gave Poppy this little Money. rabbit for the safari park. So you're gonna experience the animals starting out. Do you wanna sit here while I give a tour? Are you gonna hang out in there? That's so fun. So come on in. Let's head over here. Our one bedroom, which is nice because the view kind of reminds me a little bit of Old Town Pasadena, a little bit with the shops and the apartments on top. Mm -hmm. We have a spa, which we forgot to bring our swimsuit. That would have been fun to go into. And we have the bathroom area. This is nice because it has the double shower head. And Anthony and I really want this type of shower at our next place. And then we also have some cheese and crackers. And what is this? Yeah. We have some wine. I, love I like the dining help. table. Oh, that's so nice in the morning. I guess I should have brought her high chair now. Mm. It's pretty hard enough to pack all the stuff she mm. needed. Are you enjoying your little area? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Missy Moo. I think it's time that you try fish. Okay, come on, everybody, let's go! Squidgy there! Yeah! I'm tired. Are you tired? So she fell asleep on me for a second, nursing, when typically she would go to bed for the night. She's a little thrown off my schedule today. So. You need to go to bed. You have an early morning tomorrow. Puppy, are we gonna go see the animals? We just woke up. We have an hour before we have to leave for the safari tour. I think we'll make it at time. I have been loving my extensions. I had them a while ago and I didn't like them. I had them probably over a year ago. And because my hair was so short, they didn't blend. Every time I straighten them, I use the way heat protectant spray. When I have long hair, I really want it to be straight. I actually don't even own a curling iron because I just don't love the look on me. I slept with my hair in a braid so it wouldn't tangle. So it's a little bumpy this morning, but overall it's been staying pretty smooth. This is also my favorite dry shampoo. It's from Chlorine. You just puff it out in the area. Oh God, that was a little bit much. I live by dry shampoo. Even when I work out, I only wash my hair once a week. So my hair's clean. It's just I'm not putting shampoo in it all the time. Plus it keeps your hair a little bit shinier if you don't wash it every day. Now I'm gonna add a little hair oil. So I try to keep the oil off the top of my hair and that helps. Time to get Poppy up and get her ready. Good morning. She's so tired, I'd wake her up. Oh, you smell good. You smell like milk breath. Jay's ready to go. I have the diaper bag packed in full. Poppy was wearing a beanie, but I switched her to a tiny little bow. Let's go. Let's <laughs> it's so go. cute let's on you. Okay, let's go. Show your shoes. Seed open, oh. drop the shell, eat the seed in about two seconds. What the heck? Isn't that amazing? Oh. Well, we have our large um, habitats uh, where animals are going to be um, out wandering, about a 30 acre exhibit. So, our animals have access to as much natural space as possible. Of course, there's no predators <laughs> out there, <laughs> no lions, no, no divers, nothing like that. Um, but all the predators do live kind of the habitat which gives um, every single animal in there uh, just a little hint of an idea hey there's predators around here but they're not going to eat me right now we have always been um, a fairly large uh, breeding facility definitely have a very multi uh, like variety of focuses now but we still do a lot of breeding with especially our endangered species so when you have um, animals out there that you want to have as many babies as we, as we can, the best thing you can do is have that natural instinct still. So if they think, hey, I'm gonna get, I might get eaten tomorrow, I should probably reproduce today. It's like a mo 
motivator, right? A little bit. So not too stressed. <laughs> just enough. Yeah. Just enough stress. <laughs> the size on a giraffe when they're born, so initial birth size and weight is six feet tall. And usually somewhere around like 120 to 150 pounds. So this is what I call the pretzel. Um, you can see like she's completely laying back on her on her hind. So they do that. Then kids will do that a lot. Um, it's almost like a, a way to be kind of camouflaged in. And we're here to make sure we have options, yeah. right? Um, you know, we're actively conserving what's left and having a backup plan just in case we can't help the ones that are left. Really important example is the northern white rhino. Mm. Uh, that is one of our largest. Um, programs here when it comes to conservation, when it comes to reintroduction programs, when it comes to research, the northern white rhino, it kind of tops the list. And it's because we had northern white rhinos here at the safari park for many, many decades. And as of today, there are only two left in the entire world. And they are both females. And because they're hunted. Because they are poached for their horns, yeah. <laughs> what? You all right, Jay? She's doing good, yeah. Oh my goodness. You slept through the rhinos in the grass. Oh, you missed the rhinos. You missed it. Well, you took a little nap, huh? You slept for the tour. Hello. You missed the rhinos Happy. and You giraffes. slept for the most of the tour. What an adorable spot. This lunch area. Look at this view. So peaceful here. What do you think so far, Jay? It's fun, but it's so cool. <sighs> it's a little chilly. Is there anything you didn't know that you now know? I knew about the drops. Did you know they had incredible eyesight? No, I didn't know that. Neither did I. It's so interesting about the giraffes, how sometimes they abandon their babies if... Oh yeah, I didn't know that either. Yeah, if they don't stand up right away, they can't nurse, that's so sad. Oh yeah, I didn't know that. This? I watch Animal Planet all the time. And the fact that you can see so far. I had no idea they had I incredible had no eyesight. no idea. I'm excited for the cat enclosure. Same. Are we ready to go see some carnivores? <laughs> he looks at me like, what are you talking about? She's got these beautiful long whiskers. She does have the longest whiskers of, oh, of our kids here. <laughs> <laughs> so. People ask, like, why aren't they in the big fields with the giraffes and the rhinos? But uh, that's the real reason. They eat everything and anything, and so those fields would just be nothing. <laughs> uh, which is part of the reason why they're here to begin with. So the adults were actually wild. So she's telling him to knock it off. <laughs> um, oh my gosh. Yep. <laughs> so he still has to learn his boundaries. He's three now, so she can start saying no. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Trunk target them, so that's what we ask them to do: is to touch our hand. <laughs> um, before every behavior, it kind of gives us an idea of how they're feeling, if they're tense, uh, or if they're relaxed. Puppy's still nursing, but she fell asleep. So, what did you think of the whole tour? It was cool. I liked it. I feel like it was very interactive, and I learned so much. Well, not interactive, that, but like. Well, like that they get you really close up to the animals mm -hmm. and you can see how they live, how well they're treated. You can ask all the questions. All the questions. Yeah. As Poppy gets older, I want to bring her to these things because we really love everything they're doing here. Mm -hmm. I was really inspired by all the work they're doing and the research, even with the breast milk for the elephants and... Now that the tour is ended, we are going... To Australia. I see bunnies. Right there. All right, those are birds.
what is going on with my mask right now? <laughs> what is going on with my mask? Um, what are you doing? I'm getting this and this for coffee. And this is for, my mom's getting this and this one for my nana. There's a lot of these things go, the percentage goes back to conservation, so. <laughs> She likes that sweatshirt. It's so cute. It says um, Wildlife Park on it. San Diego. Oh. What do we have? Cheeseburgers minus a veggie. I got a veggie burger. Very we also so realized there's the carousel over there. Is that what it's called? I want to go on it with coffee. Should we go on it? Ooh, these are the yummy fries. They're like the breakfast potato fries. <laughs> okay, so I can't, I can't ride with her, so she's alone. On the tigers. I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> They're pink because of what they eat. Spaghetti. Oh my gosh, she's trying to nurse. Did you see her? Papachine. She's trying to nurse. Hurry. Your mom and nurse you. My aunt's a nurse in the car for like, well, for like 15 minutes before we go. Come on. Go. Are you getting little crabby? <laughs> okay. We're going to go to dinner, but we think that she won't be able to last. She's very sleepy. She oh. didn't get her nap. Oh, she you're so crabby nap. right now. Okay, let's get in the back. Well, you get easy to ties. Come on. Come on. You gotta walk. I'm seeing if she'll reach out for me. Walk. Come on, oh, reach out for me. Do you think she'll reach for me? Oh. <gasps> Okay, let's go. Oh my god, I look like I've had a rough day. I'm exhausted. Did not remove my makeup fully. I'm tired, but in a good way because you know it's been a good day. We decided to stay and order food from the restaurant or the hotel. We went down and got a drink first because we have a built-in babysitter. So that works out. And Jay was on her phone anyway. And Jay ordered Chick-fil-A. Went down, got a drink. Poppy's been sleeping great because she is exhausted from earlier. She was very <laughs> into the carousel. I died. So now we are enjoying our truffle pizza, black truffle pizza. Shishito peppers. We're gonna French watch a crime documentary. And we got up early for brunch. What are we gonna do for the rest of the day? Do you wanna go to Seaport Village? Mm -hmm. Or do you wanna go to the beach and put your toes in the sand? She just nodded. <laughs> oh. Poppy kisses sissy. You like not, she just lifted up. You're not allowed. Were you trying to get up on your chunks? Did you see her butt? Here. Lift her up like how she was doing. What? <laughs> she literally was like up. Oh. Do you go on your buns? She like lifted up. Wow! <laughs> Cute. She had eggs and avocado, like a big girl. With her sippy cup. That was really, really good. I'm so full. Oh, delicious. And then we have to rush out. What? <laughs> <laughs>